it's all part of the plan. <laughs> Just so happened the director of the movie, which had to go to trial, 
against a judge because of the movie for the controversy and whatever <clears throat> happened and the reason they got destroyed, he ends up bringing that last copy to director. You don't stick around. He ends up bringing the last copy to a leaf <laughs> because he pretty much knows what's going to happen. And it does end up happening. And pretty much when the movie starts, everybody starts. Who is? Everybody who's watching it. Because Chad and Kelly are too busy trying to have sex. So they end up not even really paying attention to the movie. But everybody else who is watching it, they straight black out. Eyes start going bloodshot red. It's basically almost some 28 days later type shit that start happening. But they just start raging out and going crazy. That's the thing I really actually enjoy with this. At first, like I said... I, I was doing something, man, and I wasn't even really kind of in, engaged at the episode, but then I started paying attention to it, and I wasn't too engaged. I was probably like three or four minutes not engaged with the show, and then I started paying attention to it. But anyway, once everything started ramping up and started going, it is pretty good. It is. It's pretty good. But I, would get, I guess because, I just like I said, I just recently watched uh, Black Summer, so <laughs> it's like... I don't got this formula of zombies, especially fast running zombies, and I'm not even sure they zombies or whatnot, because they just transforming almost like they ain't going into some type of deep rage or whatnot. But either way, as far as just what they did with the formula of the story and just some of the new elements that was bringing, it didn't feel like American Horror Story, and I actually enjoyed that part. It did not feel like American Horror Story. It felt like an actual horror movie. It almost was in the tradition of Tales from the Crypt short stories. But that's the thing I really enjoyed from it. And I hope they keep this formula going. And to be honest, I don't want them going back to uh, Murder House, Asylum, none of them previous things that they had in the original American Horror Story. I want them to stay away from all those things in American Horror Stories. I want to get new stories. I want to get new characters and all of that. Because this is each um, episode is going to be different stories. So, hey, let's go that route. But as far as just um, everything they brought to this, it wasn't that scary. I'm going to tell you that. It was not that scary. But it was still good. And it was entertaining to see everything and the chaos going on. Them parts was good because it was like carnage. Everything. It was mayhem. But I really enjoyed it, like I said, for them going away from the traditional route they would usually go. Like they did with the first two episodes of this new spinoff series. But, I mean, ain't too much to talk about. This, this One thing I will say, this I thought this was almost like damn near 30 minutes because it wasn't that long. But it's, it's a little bit longer than that. It's definitely almost at least, I guess, 40 to 45 minutes. But that's another thing. These stories are going to be short and contained. And that's cool with me, too. Because you know, in the original series, he used to have, like, episodes that would go over an hour. <laughs> which was all right, long as it was a good episode. But with these, you know, these are going to be short, contained stories. And I'm cool with that. Like I said, it's the, almost that traditional Tales from the Crypt. But that was pretty much my opinion and my review and a little recap on American Horror Stories Episode 3, Drive-In. Y'all let me know in the comment section, how did y'all feel about this recent episode of American Horror Stories Episode 3? Does it feel, did you enjoy it or did you want to see more of the original American Horror Story take, you know, how he has an original series? Or did you like that it differed from the original take and that it went somewhere in a different route, in a different direction? Let me know in the comment section, man. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. This is the road to 300 subs. Shout out to everybody that's checking out my videos. Shout out to all my subscribers. I appreciate the support for real, for real, man. We have Don't look! Anyone who saw it would be damaged forever. I was promoting my movie.